swimmers will plunge into the cold bay over the weekend for a very good cause. They're raising money for cancer research. KPIX 5's Roberta Gonzalez introduces us to some of those brave swimmers. Hi, everybody. We are outside the St. Francis Yacht Club here, and I am surrounded by some fantastic, talented swimmers. We're here for a really good cause, and it tells about it. Anthony here, he's the co-director of Swim Across America. What's going on this weekend? On Sunday, we will we'll be putting 275 swimmers in the water under Golden Gate Bridge, and they will swim back to Yacht Harbor, all to raise money to fight cancer. And that is a hard swim. How far is it? It's 1.5 miles, but the water is going to be warm, 65. That is warm for this time of the year. It certainly is. Dr. Howard Rosenfeld is from Children's Hospital in Oakland. Why do you participate in this event? Hi, Roberta. Uh, this is my fifth swim, and it's just spectacular. The money that's raised for cancer research for children over at Oakland Hospital has been instrumental in a lot of the research that Dr. Saab is doing. And uh, how much money have you raised so far? Well, this year, just this year, over $400,000. Woo! That is amazing. Dr. Saab, also from Children's Hospital, you're participating also. You're a beneficiary? Uh, yes, I swim in the pool, but I'm also a beneficiary of this wonderful organization. The uh, funds go to support cancer research in the Swim Across America Laboratory at Children's Hospital Oakland. We are conducting research to try and develop more targeted therapies so that we leave no child behind to cancer. Let's leave no child behind. So what do we do? Visit us online at kpix.com. We hook you up with Swim Across America. America. Meanwhile, swim across the bay, everyone. Woo! Well, you can find out more about Swim Across America on webs on our website, kpix.com. A South Bay mayoral race is heating up. The accusations of misconduct.